It's I probably dry skin. Yeah. My it? skin's still peeling. No, it's fine. It's um, right discoloration mind you I have the camera like all the way back cause <laughs> they don't need to be that close they don't need to be that close girls here and yeah so I'm doing the melon x pill um I feel like this is the only time I'll ever be able to do it because I have a week off before I start my new job so I can get it and I can just be in the house pilling all week today is Monday and we're on the way to the appointment and from what i've been told like the first couple days are gonna be the worst as far as peeling but like by the weekend i should be good so for sure by next monday i should be good but i'm going to double check when i get there but yeah it's given the next time you see me <laughs> i was gonna say next time you see me, my face will be flawless but next time you see me i'll probably be peeling mm. because i'm going to point you guys along with the journey i want to see if they'll let me vlog inside the place but you know it is a med spa so sometimes they would be like oh you know <laughs> so we'll see i'll like capture as much as i can because it was just like okay finish you know like it's painful but like uh, let's just knock it out let's just finish and knock it out um okay auto focus is on and really bothering me it's like trying to focus on my face it's like what's happening <laughs> there's a monster in the car um is it a person yeah okay okay that's better i'm still a little blurry oh 
Oh, there we go. Now we're talking. Okay, so that was like a seven. The forehead hurt the most. I don't know, maybe because that's where the bone is. Or maybe it's not a lot of fat in my forehead. <laughs> oh, a lot of filler. Um, but the forehead hurt the most. I literally felt like my forehead was bleeding. Um, the cheeks is fine. The jawline is painful and under the neck. No, no, got some on my neck. I thought she wiped me off. You gotta break me off. But this girl gets so cool. Um, so after we did the microdermal abrasion, then she gave me a fan, like a cooling fan, and was like, okay, we're gonna cleanse the skin with alcohol and it's gonna burn a little bit. That was like an eight nine. Like it literally felt like my face was on fire. And she's like, oh, just use the fan, just use the cooling fan. <laughs> so sweet, but I was like, woohoohoo! Um, you saw that in the clip. And then we put the mask on. And the mask was like tingling, but like nothing crazy. It was maybe like a six, I think a five, six. So now I have the mask on, and I have to keep this on for 10 hours, so. She put it on at 4.30, so I have to keep it on until 2.30 a.m. tonight. And they gave me instructions and a little book to guide me. And they gave me cleansers, and so I have all the things that I need. Um, yeah, but this is just really crazy because, like, when else would I be able to do this? I don't know a better time, but now... Starting a new year, right? New skin, new face, who does? New yeah. job. And I have to send them pictures every day. It's like, we're in a relationship now. I'm gonna be sending morning pics like, hey, check it in. Uh -huh. This is so scary. Like, imagine if we had kids and I came home. <laughs> like, <laughs> the kid would be like, ah! Like, do you warn them before we walk in the door? Like, daddy has something on his face. He's okay. <laughs> I feel like our kid would be like, what is that? You look crazy. Like, I don't feel like they'll be scared. <laughs> so, yeah, we're going to go home. We're going to eat and start my hibernation. <laughs> because I can't be in the sun this week. Um, but they do give you like this high intense um, sunscreen and it leaves a white cap. So it's giving, I don't want to be in the sun anyway with that. So yeah, go check back in. Maybe after I wash my face and see. She was like, don't be alarmed. Your face is a little red or a little puffy. Don't be alarmed. So we'll see at 2.30 a.m. on a white pill. I hope I can stay awake. Okay, so this is the day one, technically. So it's the day after the pill. I don't know if this should be day one or day two, but whatevs. Um, so it's nighttime, I'm about to wash my face off. No peeling yet, but it is like super tight. I can't figure out if my skin looks darker because of the like white cast sunscreen, or if that's the dark skin about to peel off. <laughs> but yeah, it's definitely like super tight. My forehead is the darkest. Like, it kind of looks like I like laid out in the sun all day and like showed up to dinner like sunburn. That's kind of how it looks and how it feels. But no real pillin' yet. I ran out today to do some errands. We'll drop orders off. I know I'm not supposed to be leaving the house, but <laughs> you know the business is booming. Um, so yeah, I really wanted to start pillin' so we can get through the pillin' process. But this is a day one night time check in. Okay. All right, so it's day three, and I'm starting to pill. It's like a subtle pill, but 
we're peeling, so that's good. Um, I have the white cast from <laughs> the, let me just show it, because, oh, did I already show it yesterday? No, not the healing cream. Oh, it is the healing cream. It's the healing cream that has, like, the sunscreen properties in it. Um, the face just feels very tight. Like, I do like this, like, ooh, mm, to, like, stretch it. But, yeah. <laughs> The peeling has started. So that's good. I will check back in later. It's like 4 o'clock. So I'll check back in before I go to bed. It doesn't look terrible. Like, if I really wanted to go to the gym, I could. I mean, you're not supposed to sweat when you're, like, peeling. But I'm not a sweater. <laughs> okay, so this is Wednesday. Nighttime. We are really peeling now. I look like a zombie. Like everything is peeling. So this is good. Peel away. <laughs> um, still like no irritation though. Just like dry and flaky. As I scratch my nose. But no, it doesn't itch or burn or anything. It's looking really dark though. But we'll see. I'm about to wash it and, you know, cleanse and hydrate and do all that. But yeah. We're peeling your honor. Especially when I do that, like, mmm, 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 mmm. Mm. It's a new dawn, it's a new day. Ah. Okay, we are definitely peeling today. <laughs> I look so crazy with the sunscreen on. I think also too because, I don't know, I feel like maybe because I'm sleeping on my pillows and they're like cotton pillows and my face is rubbing. Cause when I wake up in the morning, it's like, <gasps> but we're making progress. Today's Thursday. So yeah, I can keep peeling Friday, Saturday, and hopefully by Sunday I'm done. <laughs> yeah. Mm. Mm. Hey, this is the nighttime check-in. Day, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday. So, three, day three. This is nighttime of day three. Lots of peeling. And the chin is really like, ooh, ooh. I'm still waiting for this forehead to start peeling, but um, it's a little itchy today. I've been like, dee, 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 like taking stuff and like, ooh, 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 trying not to scratch it. My cheeks is looking real light. We are up here is peeling, and it's like I'm like a pimple popper, which is why I'm in this predicament that I'm in because the pimple pop in leads to acne scarring but like oh it's itching now ooh, ooh, ooh. they're like just tap it ooh. um I had to make sure no skin came off <laughs> um but yeah it's like you're so tempted to just like like scrape it off but you can't do that so I'm about to wash it off like a gentle cleanser. Ooh, even my nose is itching. But yeah, we're peeling away. I feel like I could see the new skin under. We're supposed to have a double date tonight. They had to cancel that. Um, yeah, and tomorrow's Friday. I think I'll be in the house tomorrow too. Yeah. So this is day, oh, so itchy. This is day three. Night three. I will check back in tomorrow morning, which will be Friday, which will be day four. I woke up like this. I woke up like this. Okay. <laughs> it's Friday. So it's technically like day four, day five. Let me find some good light. Um, we're peeling away. 
so yeah, this is this is the vibe. <laughs> it's so crazy because I was like sleeping like this, and then I woke up, and then it was like all this like skin on my arm, and I was like, wow, <laughs> my face is on my arm. Um, so last night it was kind of itchy, and I was just like tap 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 it. Today it just feels like very dry, very tight. But I am about to wash it, you know, cleanse it, and then put this, the sunscreen on. Um, but I do have to go into the office on Monday, so I'm hoping, <laughs> like, we finish peeling soon because I can't go anywhere. I had plans tonight, Saturday, and I can't go anywhere. This is a big piece flaking off. But yeah, about to get to work and do the routine. <laughs> okay, so this is the whole process. I have put the, I've cleansed it, put the retinol, the healing cream, and the brightening cream. The healing cream is basically a sunscreen. I'm sure I've said this before, but this white cast is crazy. But they're like, you have to put it on because it has healing properties. <laughs> um, but I just text my girl, um, my girl, like, like we're friends. I just text the girl that did the facial. And I was like, okay, Monday I have to go into office. So what can I use instead of this? Because this is cool for in the house. And I'm going to be in the house for two more days. But come Monday... I can't walk around like this. So I asked her like what other sunscreens can I use? Cause I usually use um, Super Goop. I usually use this bad boy. Like this is my go-to. The Super Goop Unseen Sunscreen. Not an ad, just my go-to. Like my daily, everyday go-to is really light, no white cast, and you know, just the last step in my skincare. Um, so I'm wondering if I can use that on Monday, but I don't know. I don't know if like there's chemicals in it that's going to interact with what's going on and make it worse. So I'm waiting for her to text me back. Happy Friday. Mm, mm. I'm like the same clothes as my shirt. That's scary. This is the nighttime check-in. My nose is the funniest part because it looks like the boogers on my nose, but it's not. Um, you know what the crazy thing is? Like, this is like the perfect time to get this because I'm off all this week, and I could just be in the house peeling, and chilling, peeling and chilling. That should be my caption. But yeah, it kind of like grounds you and like forces you to sit down. We were supposed to go to like the first Friday at the museum. We were supposed to have date night, like a double date last night. And everything got canceled. Now my eyes are watering. Yeah, just pillin' and chillin', no real update. I put another layer of the um the sunscreen, the healing cream. Cause they say it's not just sunscreen, like it has like healing ingredients and so um my part's looking a little red so i had um put it on like when i woke up and then i put like another coat on at four and so like this is the coat <laughs> it just looks very ashy this part is a little itchy <sighs> Maybe I should take a nap because I keep yawning. <laughs> okay, bye. Hello, I am Bella Adit. <laughs> no, just kidding. Um, but his forehead, wowza. So today is Saturday. It is day five. Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday. So yes, day five, morning. Um, I just woke up. I haven't even like washed or anything, but I feel like we're making good progress. Like you can already kind of see the new skin. 
I just look lighter. Which is not really the vibe, but <laughs> um, yeah, no, it looks really good. I mean, I feel like we're like maybe 60% done peeling, which is good because I have like two more days that I can stay in the house and peel today and tomorrow. So, um, yeah, forehead is coming along nicely. It's like so tempting to just be like, but I know you don't want to do that. Um, and it's so crazy too because I feel like when I like wake up in the morning it's like all these flakes on my pillow on my bed which is kind of nasty but it's like it'd be coming off in the middle of the night um big flake there so yeah about to wash and cleanse and treat it and do all of that and then I'll be back day Hello! Alright, so it's the morning of day six, so it's Sunday. And I feel like I'm pretty much done on the face. I mean, not really, still a little bit over here. The forehead is taking the longest. Um, so, <laughs> I don't know what I'm about to do tomorrow. I might have to peel this shit off or try to cover it. I don't know. But I feel like what I'm gonna do at work is like, I'm gonna be like, oh, I just got back from vacation. I'm just a little sunburned. <laughs> like, if it's really, really not done peeling. But I feel like it should be. It's like not that much left. So I have like all day and all night to peel. And then tomorrow morning, I gotta wake up and see what's going on. Um. Yeah, I feel like I just look lighter. <laughs> yeah. I mean, I, I, I think once I like wash my face and moisturize and I do all that, like it'll look better. But right now it just looks dry and ashy. But definitely lighter. Like my skin tone feels like it looks a lot lighter. Yeah. I don't know how I feel yet. <laughs> Okay, so today is Sunday, Sunday night, and I've just like washed and treated and you know, boom, boom, boom. And it looks like the pillow is done. There's just like a little bit left on my forehead. And so I'm hoping that'll be gone by tomorrow because tomorrow's Monday, so. But yeah, I think the peeling is done done um I do feel like my face looks brighter um yeah but I'm gonna keep you know keep you know cleansing retinol brightening cream sunscreen because you're supposed to do it for 25 days they say that once you stop peeling you're like at the halfway mark so you have to keep doing everything but this is good I mean I could leave my house today if I wanted to I just would have put on the head um Funny enough, we had company and I just put a do-rag on because <laughs> my forehead still looks a little crazy. But the doll is back. I could leave the house tomorrow. But I'm gonna keep updating. But yeah, this is day six. Yeah, because Monday tomorrow will be day seven. So yeah, day six check-in. I am not with Metro anymore. I'm with HFT. <laughs> <coughs> okay. I know. It's like, wh uh, who, what, where? Who is she? <sighs> so it's day 25 of the pill. It's actually the last day. Um, and this is how I'm looking. I'm trying to find the best light in here. Maybe here. So, I mean, I'm looking very light skinned, <laughs> but I feel like it looks good. Like, there's still a little dark spots there, but overall, it looks really good. Um, so I'm going to the place today to get like the aftercare kit, which is like a cleanser, moisturizer, sunscreen, they are retinol. 
Um, so I'll get that today. But yeah, this is the end result. My hair didn't grow out a little bit. <laughs> yeah, I'm like a new person. Okay, let me get up close. So you can see. It's a little bit of like hair growth going in. That's not hyperpigmentation, it's just my hair. But yeah, I am into it. So let me sit down so I can give like my real thoughts. Okay, I look even more light skin. <laughs> now it's giving Billie Jean Michael Jackson. Um, okay, so I would give the whole process like maybe eight out of ten. Um so I do feel like it's very expensive for what you're getting, right? Like I think everything was like a thousand. It was maybe like eight, nine, and then taxes and tip. So maybe it was eight and then like taxes and tips, like everything came to like a thousand. Um and I peeled for like a week. So I think that if you're getting it, you have to consider that, right? Like you have to consider the fact that you will be peeling for a week. For me, it was cool because I wasn't working. I was like about to start my new job, so it was fine. But I don't know many people that have like a week where they can just be in the house peeling. I mean, not unless you work remote and you're not on camera, then I guess it's fine. And you also can't be in the sun. So it's like, you gotta have a week to peel and then like two, three weeks to like not be in the sun. So you should not get this before vacation. <laughs> um, winter time is probably the best time to get it too. Um, was not painful, just itchy, dry, peeling, flaky. Um, but yeah, I mean, I like the results. I'm just waiting for um, my color to come back because it does look like I'm bleaching. <laughs> Somebody said that, like, you been bleaching? And I'm like, no, it's just a pill. But yeah, I'm satisfied. Um, I know some people who do it, like, every couple years. I will not be doing it again. <laughs> I'm going to try my best to take care of my skin even more so that I don't have any more acne scars or hyperpigmentation and sunscreen retinol all that so hopefully i won't have to do it again but yeah i give it like an eight out of ten if you're looking for that hardcore pill and you know stubborn get rid of stubborn acne scars and stubborn hyperpigmentation man this is the vibe <laughs> yeah toodles okay it looks real good from this angle. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna bump it back up to like a nine, nine out of 10. So this may be minus one for how expensive it is because the results are really good. And this is day 25, like, what's up? You really gotta stick to her retinol, sunscreen, brightening cream to get the desired results. So yeah, I'll put the, um, the details of the place in the bio check them out and i put the girl who did it check her out yeah let's go let's go let's go yeah let me know what y'all think like comment subscribe ooh ooh, ooh. <laughs> okay bye for all this time <laughs>